Over here at Helux, we've been hearing this a lot lately. We have these super shoes. We've had them for a few years, but we don't have a lot of studies on injury rates. I don't think injury rates have changed significantly. I think the location of the injuries have changed. You might be wondering, can running in these super shoes with their really thick foam and carbon plates actually cause more injuries for runners? Well, we have been hearing from orthopedic surgeons and physical therapists about more midfoot stress fractures for runners that are exclusively in super shoes. And now there's actually two published research articles that talk about why this could be occurring. Now, not every runner that runs in super shoes is gonna get a midfoot stress fracture, but there are some things that we can do to reduce the risk. First up, during development, we highly recommend that all running shoe brands are testing their product. We like to use our force plate over here to see how much rolling in and rolling out is occurring in the shoes. Too much of that motion can actually increase the likelihood of causing a stress fracture. Now, if you're a runner and you like to wear super shoes, the answer is really easy. Just don't do all of your training in super shoes. We've actually found that it's a lot better for runners to rotate their shoes. So maybe have a neutral cushion shoe and maybe a more thin minimal shoe in your rotation to complement the runs that you're doing in these super shoes. If we do that, we have the best likelihood of keeping our runners fast, happy, and healthy in all the shoes that they're going to be running in.